These five people all claim to be members of the O'Donnell family, but one of them is not telling the truth. It's the game that asks you to decide which member of a close-knit clan is actually a relative stranger. No relation. And now, here's the host of our show, Mike Crow. Thank you so much, Jennifer. Hello, everyone. My name is Mike, and this, in fact, is No Relation. Today, at least for the next half hour, you're going to have an opportunity to meet the O'Donnell family and try and figure out which one of them is an imposter. Now, just out of school and join life. Great. <laughs> Ryan. I'm uh, Ryan. I'm also the, the middle son, and I'm, a, uh, I'm studying to be a teacher, and I'm also a football coach. Great. And finally. I'm Everybody, if you're just joining us, we're right in the middle of round one. The O'Donnells are being questioned. We've heard from Pat so far. Ryan's in the hot seat. Ricky Paul. We uh, hmm, that's not what it says here. Oh, <laughs> uh, you have an interest in computers? And oh, they call um, you Mr. New Age. Yeah, well, it's just uh, I work at a high school. A lot of the, a lot of the teachers and a lot of the coaches I work with are kind of, they're not into the computers, so I pretty much know where the on-off button is. So, so I kind of help them out. You were recently married, is that yes, correct? Yes, I married almost a month ago. And did you write a letter or to somebody right after the wedding or to? No, my brother who set up the whole thing did. Mm-hmm. Oh. Ryan O'Donnell, what yes. is the O'Donnell Dunk Fest? Oh, the O'Donnell Dunk Fest is a, it's a basketball tournament that my uh, older brother and I, Kevin, put on. It's a two-on-two -two, uh, big basketball tournament that we've been doing since 1988, right in our driveway, and we have all our friends come, and we throw in a big party for all, night, all day long. How, how has it evolved over the years? Oh, it's evolved. We've, we've gone up to having uniforms, and <laughs> we videotape it, and uh, I'm, next year I'm actually coming out through fireworks and the whole splash. It's gotten to be a big production. We like to... Wow. What, well, what's special about the trophy? Oh, the trophy. trophy is just kind of, uh, I put the trophy together. What's well, solid gold, I'm sure. Go ahead, Lisa. Oh, ooh, my turn. Okay. <clears throat> when were you married, and how could your proposal have been considered a team effort? Uh, I was married uh, July 5th. Okay. And uh, the proposal was uh, my brother and s several other of my friends uh, drove up to Reno, and uh, we surprised my wife where we first, me uh, where we first met, a little island uh, in a river. And then uh, we had a sign put up across the river, and I written, Marry Me with Christmas lights. And then, oh. I, and then I reached for the ring, and they lifted up the sign across the river. Oh, my gosh. We had gosh. a little hidden video camera and music playing. It was really nice. That is so yeah. romantic. That's wonderful. What, no fireworks? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Ryan, thanks. Head on through the blue door. We're going to welcome Stephen right now. Stephen, come on in and...